We were down at the Smith barn one day, cabin first calf heifers. Dale was the boss, and to give you an idea of what kind of guy Dale was, Pancho named him El Gallo con Espuelas, which means the rooster with spurs. And he does kind of walk with his chest stuck out and sort of cocky and wears them big old jingling rowls, always wearing a bright scarf. Well, he came a-striding in down there one morning pretty early, just dressed up fit to kill. Brand new shirt and everything, I mean, he was really proud. Well, George had been there all night, and he had a heifer and a squeeze shoot trying to pull this calf, and he'd pulled for all he was worth, and he was plumb give out. Well, Dale saw him and said, What's the matter with you? Can't you pull this calf? Get out of the way and let me do it. Well, George wasn't about to argue. He'd been working all night a heifer for a long time anyway. Well, Dale stepped around there behind the heifer, propped his feet up against the bottom of the squeeze chute, grabbed a hold of them two old bee handles and just reared back. Well, that calf was coming straight out. And he had his head just right, and he was a big old calf. And Dale, whenever he gets to doing something, he grits his teeth and smiles just like a jack-o'-lantern and squints his eyes. He had a good grip, and I mean, he was lean back like a water skier. As the calf started to come, the nice, smooth, round little forehead on the calf pressed up on the heifer's rectum and cleaned it slicker than a whistle. There was a stream about an eighth of an inch wide and two inches thick that came arcing out like a rainbow. It just missed the brim of his hat and splattered all over his face, in his mouth, down the front of his shirt, and he couldn't do nothing because he was reared back so far. If he'd let go, he'd have fell flat on his back. So he just hung on till the calf came out and crashed in a soggy pile on top of him. Dale came to life. <coughs> he was spitting in the cousin, and he raised his head just in time, pretty as you please, to see that heifer clean her afterbirth right in his lap. This is Baxter Black from under there.